Hello there, great people. I hope you are doing well. Greetings from Portugal, Nuno here. So today, Apple released uh, macOS Mojave 10.14.1 Beta 2. Now, trying to you know, please every viewer, since I read all the comments, some of you like to see the raw data, some of you like to see the bugs. So we are going to uh, talk a little bit about all the things. Let's start with the raw data and then the bugs that are fixed or not fixed on this release. So the build number for this beta 2, it is the 18B50C, the specs of this machine. You can pause it and see it and compare it to your machine. The download was about 2.4 gigabytes for this beta 2. Uh, regarding the Geekbench on the first beta, uh, let me minimize it here. This is the first beta and the second one, it is this one, let me minimize also. So we are seeing a decrease on the multi-score and you know almost the same on the single core. What I find found is that the final build of macOS Mojave has higher results than these betas, okay? Now, regarding the compute or the metal performance on this release and, uh, you know, this beta 2 and beta 1, on the beta 1 it was this result and the beta 2 also this, it was a little bit higher than the beta 1, but even then it was lower than the final release. The final release we reached a result of 39,000. Now, raw data and Geekbench aside, what are the bugs that I encountered on the beta one? The first of them was, is on Safari. This build or this version of Safari is the 12.0.1. And when I go to YouTube, for example, you know, I found I find that on the beginning, as you can see, it is a little bit, there is a stutter, there is, you know, a lag, and then everything seems to be okay. On the beta one, the issue was present, on the beta two, is still present once again. When I open, for example, Chrome, none of that uh, happened, so I believe it's not a problem of you know this release but is a problem of safari okay so for example if i go to youtube and i scroll down everything is smooth okay so this is not fixed yet on uh, this second build facetime i will not open for privacy reasons i test it you know the beta one and beta two you know again the group facetime it's available it's, you know, it's present. I tested with two people. It's still not yet optimized at its maximum. It is a beta, but it, it, it is working. Of course, of course, you have to have an, an iPhone, but it is working. I didn't test, of course, with 32 people. Okay, that's too many people to test with FaceTime. Um, now, for example, Final Cut, we are still waiting and Apple uh, didn't release yet, you know, an update for uh, for Final Cut. I don't know why they did it. They updated, you know, uh, Logic and um, Main Stage for music production. But Final Cut is still, you know, on the fence. I don't know what is going on. Still not updated, and the same issue uh, remains since all the betas, the final build, this the beta one and beta two. Uh, uh, after the final build still remains when you are exporting a video and you open Safari for example when you are waiting for the export uh, of the video uh, you know everything is very very slow and of course with the Geekbench that you saw this machine is more than capable of running you know uh, many apps uh, at the same time so uh, Final Cut is not, uh, it's not an issue of macOS Mojave, it is an issue of Final Cut. I'm saying, of course, every time I, a new release is launched, I'm always saying this and uh, let's hope Apple doesn't forget Final Cut 
because that's you know one of the reasons that I still use uh, the Mac. Regarding you know there isn't anything new uh, here. All the apps seem to seem to work pretty well. Some of most of them are already optimized for macOS Mojave. No issues there. Some of them are not, but all of the apps that I have here uh, work without any issues whatsoever. Okay, guys. Now there are some things that are being reported, you know, in some websites. For example, the rendering, the font rendering, or the font smoothing uh, on some applications, and uh, this is an issue that occurs on um, non-retina displays. There is macOS Mojave, you know, as this issue for non-retina displays, the font smoothing or font re uh, rendering. There is a workaround, there is a terminal command uh, in order for you to revert that. If you want me to make um, a tutorial on how to do it, put, not, put on the comments below, it will be a quick video and I will tell you on uh, how you can do it. Also, if you want to see how to install or you know, um, Mac OS Mojave on non-supported Macs. So, Macs before uh, 2012. Go ahead, put on the comments below, and I will make a tutorial on how you can do it. Also, now, guys, there isn't anything new. There isn't no no new wallpapers. You know, the same dynamic wallpapers over here. You know, these are the same things. No issues here. Everything seems to work very well very smooth but again the issues remain on safari you know uh, rendering the pages for example safari, uh, on youtube uh, still remains photos it's okay everything seems to be perfect keep in mind this is just a, a first look i just installed you know two hours ago and you know was testing and this is the issues that i encountered and the bugs that are still present of course, I will do a follow-up video, you know, in the next 48 hours and I will post again a new video on the issue. So, guys, for now this is all. Thank you so much for watching and uh, stay safe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.